Snestrunk. Hey, what's up? This is Snestrunk back at the Invention Center thing for Robotrek. And uh, I forgot something last time. Let's check it out. I forgot to command some attacks for my robot. What you do is you command a uh, either R, L, or X for your commands for your guy. And what you want to do is you, in my opinion anyway, for this game, you want to just do, you want to have one spam attack. It's called RRR. Just, and that's just sword, 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 basically. And then you can name it anything you want. And I want to name my attack Murder. Because that's what it is. You murder your guy with your sword. And just as a backup attack, uh, I think you want to do... Let me think. Shit. Uh, let's just do LLR. Yeah, I think that's right. There's two attacks you want to do. I know RRR is one, and then LLR. That works. Whatever. I don't care. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Let's name this one... Uh, uh, crash. I guess. Where's the, where's the damn H? There. <laughs> that works. That's fine. Good for me. Yeah, you need at least two to uh, auto auto spam anytime you face an enemy. So that that way, anytime you see an enemy, you could just instead of going through the process of just freaking you know spamming an attack and going to like whatever, you can just press a button and do it that way. Well, I'll show you when we get there. Hey, what the hell? Oh. No, I don't want to save. Oh, fine, whatever. I'll save anyway. Whoops. Let's go. Come on. There we go. All right, so those kids are in trouble, so let's go save those kids and see what's going on over at my dad's house in the quote-unquote suburbs, which is about 14 steps away. <laughs> Father and and uh, nice and and uh, nicely named father's house. He has nothing in his uh, mailbox. Uh oh, shit! There's a bad guy there. Oh no! My dad is dealing evil with evil people. <laughs> Is that what a trumpet sounds like? Well, whatever. That's cool. Nice job, Dad. <laughs> I did that already. Oh, okay. Oh, cool. Thanks. Now we have a surprise horn. It sounds like an explosion crossed with a fart, which is also an explosion, I guess. Let's find out what Dad has to say about this shit. Hmm. See, this game does a decent job explaining stuff to a certain extent, but sometimes it doesn't, it's, it's just kind of confusing because the translation is just a little bit off. It's like listening to a crazy person, like a crazy homeless person on a, on a street corner. Honest to God, like some of the explanations here are like, what? What the hell does that mean? You can power them up, okay. Okay. And I have free stuff here. 
back here. And yeah, there's more books back here. In fact, there's a uh, level one back here. There's an invention room back here too. Cool. But we don't need that at all. So let's get out of here. Who gives a shit? Nope. Don't need anything more from you. Too bad. So sad. What? What does that mean? Okay. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. What's going on here? No, I don't want to come with you. Well, too bad, so sad. We're going to fight? That's right. It's the first battle of the game. God damn it. And yeah, you see what he did there? He rolled out his robot in a ball like it was a Pokemon. And you see what it... Yeah. It's long explanation there. <laughs> if I'm going to start... Do it one sh one bit at a time there. Yeah, soldier, go run away. Go run to your home, to your mama. But yeah, what you do there is you just roll out your, your robot and he fights for you. Yeah, you. let's go visit our freaking family at the cemetery. Okay, that's where they are. What the fuck? This game is weird sometimes. I don't get it. Whatever. <laughs> okay. Let's move it along. Let's go back to Rococo real quick. See if anything's happened. Whoa. Uh-oh. People are s talking serious about shit. Uh-oh. No. Those kids that were talking shit about me got in trouble? You expect me to help them after they were talking smack? Oh, well, let's go home. <laughs> well, you have no useful information. Eh, whatever. Okay. <sighs> what do I do next? Okay, so after talking to them, does that unlock the next spot on the map? Okay, it does. Never mind. Okay. I thought I had to do something else to unlock that. Okay, let's go to the forest. And let's... Oh, goodness. That's right, hacker monsters are lurking about. Oh, there's one right there. Here we go. It's our second battle of the game. And he rolls out his monster. Let's go down and let's get this guy. And in order to get anybody from a distance... You have to shoot a distance weapon, which is a bomb. And you see the meter right there underneath him? You gotta wait till that's full to attack again. Kinda like Chrono Trigger. Once that's full, yeah, you're at the mercy of this guy. There we go. And the megs of data there that appear at, underneath him at, at the end of a battle, the megs of data are towards leveling up. Okay, let's face this next mushroom thing here. So there, there aren't random battles, but there are battles. Oh yeah, and see the Pokeballs right there? The proto Pokeballs, I should say. If you get those, you get more uh, megs of data, which go t more towards uh, leveling up. Wow, okay, this is happening very quickly. <laughs> And this guy attacked me from behind, so he gets to... Yeah. So a lot is happening at once, and hopefully I'll have, a lot, I'll have some time to explain what the hell is going on. Anyway, if you come... Wow, a thousand gold pieces at that point. Okay, that's cool. But, uh, yeah, let's attack this guy. As you can already tell, the music is already super annoying. And uh, yeah, there's three planes on a battle screen. Top, middle, and bottom. And uh, you have close range attacks, short range attacks, and long range attacks. In order to do long range, which you'll have to do pretty much every time to get these guys on the first point, on the first uh, 
uh, first screen or when you first get there on the first battle screen, you have to do the bomb attack. After that, you do what I just did there, which is a sword. And uh, most of the time, you just press the R button to get that. Sometimes enemies will leave a Pokeball there, Pokeball looking thing there to for money. That's cool. Here's another battle. I'm gonna edit most of these out, and the and the other uh, and the other uh, episodes. Sometimes when you hit the Pokeballs, they explode. So sometimes they don't always have something on them. This is going really fast, by the way. I didn't expect this game to go this fast. So yeah, wow. Okay, so there we go. <laughs> I hope to be more prepared for the next uh, Let's Play. Sorry about that. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day. See you next time.